All right, turn 38. Dude, I just lost an oligarch. Uh, the queen consort being head of the family is okay. I'm pretty sure we lost one of the people we had a shit ton of um, influence on. All right, what is this? Soldier merchant for 580. 580 is a lot, but we can get that. Okay, meanwhile. Oh, meanwhile, we died. That's bad. These are axes. I'm not to my unique unit tech. I don't have the ability to protect this. Roman units have showed up out of the fog and stunned me. Feels bad. All around. Oh, this is going to be a short one. Okay. Um. Fluffy's gonna stop playing with me if every time he attacks me I just keel over and die. Alright. I don't recall queuing another worker here. What the fuck are we gonna do about this? This unit is dead, sadly. So we get into the city. Start building a wall, which we cannot rush. And we need chariots. I need 400 next turn. Have we rushed anything here? We don't have developing culture here, it's irrelevant. And I don't really want to stop this since it is military production in one second here. All right, let's start here. I don't think this city survives though. Remember that military force we've been monitoring? Well, here it comes. Okay. Let's go scouting. All right. Still need these workers. Dude, I don't think regular warriors do anything, so not without a lot more iron. We need axes. Alright. Great achievers. This is this stuff. Do we sell a reason? We have plenty of food. We should sell a resource to take advantage of this. We should grab the soldier. I don't think there's anything I can do to make this unit stronger right now. They're both commanders. We have 500 military points, maybe. I don't know if the city can survive this attack. Depends how long. It depends if he's just clearing this and settling a city there, which is annoying. Losing our warrior certainly is annoying to a stun, no less. is really annoying, but what can I do about it? All right. Um, I think the rest of this is where we mostly want to be. Moving military up there as rapidly as we can. What's the worker? The worker's here. So we need a worker available next turn for the stronghold, which we will have. We need a mine. And we need lumber. All of which is fine.
tribal mercenaries with legitimacy. You think it puts the unit on cooldown? I guess we could try it and see. Does. I bought them both. I mean, he's he's going to be wrong. His units are going to be steadfast. They're going to absolutely destroy. That one's not steadfast. That one is. That one is. That one is not. There's a road coming my way. Alright. Is, is it even worth building this? Like this unit this feels like it does almost nothing for us. It takes me a thousand orders to move it anywhere near a relevant location. I don't think so. Okay. Um I'm going to convert 200. Oh, I've got this one worker. Uh, lumber. So we're a couple turns off starting those archers, and we are using our lumber faster than we're generating it. So this is probably another lumber mill with some chops along the way. turn we start our stronghold one chariot out this turn which will move up with the rest of our forces when we can and hopefully we'll get axe tech next is the dream okay uh can i do anything else we could she's getting more well she's a governor i was gonna say she's getting more interesting because she generates civics which are gonna need to rush people but it takes forever to come back Uh, assigned a general, other military is busy, this one's not. Is it worth slapping a general on here? How old is she? 46? Doesn't make her faster. Doesn't make her do more damage. Doesn't seem that relevant. Who knows? I don't think we have, this is prior to that. We are Warden and Eagle-Eyed, like maybe this isn't entirely useless. I don't know if the stun stuns the unit in the city or not. I think it does, but it might not. She'll like being made a general, but it won't be particularly large of a difference that is. But that's a long time. We have to save civics. Not that it matters for the general, but we're going to have to save up some civics because we're going to have to rush at least one of these archers. All right. Let's send it back. 21 orders not used. Ew. Okay. Turn 39. There's now a road with two workers. Is that three workers? There's three workers roading straight to the city. I, 
I don't know what to do when I know a push is coming, but I don't really have any options to deal with it. Let's assume it's coming earlier, maybe. I don't see how I defend two turn Axemen. Maybe. Ah, nice. Nice timing on this raid. Perfect. Just really what we wanted to see. Discovered sovereignty. Okay, we need an immediate, I don't have shit for s I, um, stone, I need an immediate, um, sit, not sit it down, what's the other one, stronghold. I have to buy the stone, which is fine, I need a, this is not the tech we needed. So I guess this is navigation for the reroll. We could just take spears for the reroll. I don't want spears versus axes, but spears and axes give me macemen. Which maybe have some chance of slowing that down. Alright, pop-ups are minister or 330 civics. I would love a minister, but 330 civics is an immediate rush of something. Kid is going to be studying politics. Hundred and sixty science. Could be really good. I mean good series of events, though I'd like that minister. Alright, um we're gonna cancel that, I think. And do anything else queued that we'd like to get rid of that could give me back some no we're gonna have to buy it all right that's fine i think i should use the horse to kill this unit ten year chariot's really unexciting This is such bad timing on those. I need this unit in there. And that needs to die, so it's probably That leaves at four and a four and one. There's four. Do we have any benefits here? No. No as well. So it takes three attacks to kill it annoyingly. Okay. That's our timer, three years. We are very much out of stone.
What am I missing? The wood? It's gonna be 150 wood in three turns. Do about all the wood I need to chop is in here. I'm just gonna lose the city to like an alpha strike, right? Like it's just gonna be. We'll see. Maybe these axes. Are slowing down. Maybe. Hard to imagine that 74 military points are worth that, but they're never going to get a chance to anything else ever again. So maybe. What's the combat strength? It's not even that bad. No. Not unless I'm going to rush a chariot here. Which I don't think I am. Maybe here, though. Let's send it back. All right, turn 40. I don't want her becoming timid. These both suck. I hate this event. <laughs> Our whole family is timid from exactly that event. Take science. Take free chariots. Ooh, axes though, and civics, huh? He attacked the city yet? Yeah, full surround, kills the city in one hit kind of deal. My guy is stunned inside the city. It's kind of bad news. All right, what can we get in range this turn? Looks like I should have rushed that other chariot. Is this a ranged attacker? Did that much damage as a ranged attacker? That's not a ranged attacker. Rip. All right. So they're both in defensive tiles. I can only get one unit to attack it. Two units with a force march is not enough. How far can this one get? Two and a half. No damage there. Two and a half. Two and a half. Two 
two and a half. It's seven and a half. We have two more damage to do. Can't even move it out of the city because it's stunned. I don't think it should be able to be stunned in the city. So I can't get our urban bonus. I really would like to not go any closer than that, but that's only one and a half, so it's not enough. Very irritating. All right, there's four attacking tiles that we can reach on that unit. I'm gonna have to force march a billion people to get there. I mean, this is more than just a chariot. It just has increased penalties long term. We have good promotions on these characters, but they're not going to get time to activate them. They're going to die to these warriors. That's two. Two and a half, three times is 7.5 plus two is nine. So we do get it without this. That's not two and a half, that's two. And that's two. Fuck, I miscounted. So it's actually two, four, six off the three warriors, all of whom have to be force marched. Another two here, two and a half is eight and a half. And then I still have to use the slinger. Or nine and a half. Ew. any choices here so I'm kind of annoyed that the city center doesn't do anything for zone of control dude I can hit that one so hard maybe I don't want to attack that one why does this one get because it's not fortified can I just kill that it's got the stunning unit right next to it is the problem. There's no way though, right? A lot more expensive militarily too. It's two and a half there. I think we have to kill this. I'm getting tired of being axemen pushed by people. Like I want some counterplay to this. Same for all three of these tiles. almost our whole turn to do that four force marches is super punishing for our composition here um 
I do want another chariot. I think it rushes here is where we want it. Does it matter which family? Not much. I do give up an attack by that ordering. Do I care? I guess I do care. Two ninety to civics to rush that one. Two seventy for this one. 260 for that one. I don't want to rush out of this city. So it's got to be this one. All right. Uh, this kid needs to be tutored. Is she okay? She's not ill yet, so let's tutor there. What happened to the event? Where, where did the event go? I don't know what the hell happened with that, okay. And one action left, three workers. Okay, that's gonna get hit again, but not die, that's fine. Buy some time there. Drain the entire military reserves of the of my nation, which is kind of ridiculous. I guess we're gonna want to put these horses on next round, so having that be available to do that's good. I need quarries as well, and I need wood. I'll send it back. Uh, 